I came in with an impression of what I thought auditing was. Before coming to CSA audits, what I knew about auditing was the IRS. But I actually knew nothing about auditing. In my mind, it was purely financial. It was people get audited, it's a pain, no one wants to deal with it. But now I spend a lot of time explaining to other people that auditing is not just about taxes. Oftentimes, most students believe that auditing is only financial. Whereas when they come into a government environment, we do much more than financial audits. We do operational audits. We're looking at the operations of the department for economy and efficiency and effectiveness. When I hire an intern, some of the things that I'm looking for, first of all, is is this individual agile and flexible? Because our environment is so fast paced and we're switching from project to project depending on what's going on in the government at any given time. So primarily I've been assisting with the audit on um, facilities management practices across city departments. A citywide facilities maintenance audit. I've also been assisting with the housing authority audit program. The start of the homelessness audit. An audit of the sheriff's IT function. Cash transactions program. We're starting a new audit on the Department of Public Health's Environmental Health Department. And I also assist with the whistleblower program. Mm -hmm. but we're almost and then additionally, I really enjoy having staff have, who have strong critical thinking skills. Because I believe the basis of auditing is not do you know how to audit, but do you have critical thinking skills to think through processes. Some skills that I feel like I've developed, even though I've only been here for a short time, are quick, in-depth analysis and research. Analytical skills, there's a lot of taking a large amount of information and then compacting it into very concise reports because we have a big focus on readability. If you're transmitting this information to an audience, you need them to be able to understand it. So I work with the whistleblower program primarily. My core duties in the whistleblower program are investigating uh, complaints against fraud, waste, and abuse. My internship with CSA Audits prepared me for full-time employment because I knew I would have to challenge myself in order to be an auditor. Staff at CSA really fostered a network of authentic feedback and communication, and they pointed out areas where I needed to grow. Well, one of the things I really like about the working atmosphere at CSA Audits is that they actually give you quite a bit of autonomy. I feel like it demonstrates trust in me. The environment really lends itself to everyone feeling super collaborative and wanting to get to know one another, which I think, at the end of the day, inspires a better work environment and gives you a better work product. I believe that it really is a great experience because it provides an opportunity to have a better understanding of how government works. And I think what I've learned so far is that every audit is unique every day, there's different learning opportunities. So the recommendations that we make in audits, I can honestly go home at the end of the day and say that I've contributed to city services in a better way. Even if you're not familiar with what auditing is, to definitely try it out, it's been a really, really awesome experience. It turns out there's a whole world of auditing that I didn't know about beforehand, like performance and interviews, and so that's been exciting. Audits is a lot broader than I ever, than I ever knew before.